Do I have more chest hair since I shaved my pubes, or is it just I'm aware of the lack of hair there and I'm feeling... And when I look at it, that looks the hairiest I've ever been, but is it just comparison? People reach an age when they talk more of the past than of the future, and my mother has reached that age. She talks to me when we speak about her dead mother, about her dead aunts and uncles, about the previous hair colours of people now dying and greying care homes. She talks to me when we speak about people she hasn't seen for 30 years, about things that haven't happened for 50 years. She talks to me when we speak about the town she left when she was seven years old, as if she still thinks of that as home. She talks about the one holiday she went on alone with my dad back in the 80s, and she talks about things that happened in my childhood I don't remember. But none of these are stories. My mother speaks single sentence memories that are disconnected, and she neither expects nor cares for a response. And I know what this means, and I don't like it. My mother is like an old woman now, and I really wish she wasn't. I'm going to do some more. I play on dating apps in between panic attacks, half asleep on friends' sofas. I tell strangers I like karaoke and my dog, but what I really like is being held. I am a man and I will not disregard my principles in exchange for anything, except money, attention or sex. What else is good in here? I mean, they're all good, obviously. It's the, the, the greatest collection of poetry I'm aware of. The, I just don't feel comfortable reading lots of them, especially to you. <laughs> um, that one's sad. I had to go and hide to cry at Christmas when I realised I no longer felt safe in a car driven by my dad. The D of Dad is lowercase there. Poems. I had to go and hide to cry at Christmas when I realised I no longer felt safe in a car driven by my dad. I cannot scream, fuck off to the other side of the bar to the man who is depressing me. I cannot scream, I see your fucking shoulders and your hands and your eyes and I recognised my dad a few years ago. I cannot tell him to fuck off because this is a public space, this is mine no more than his. But he's fucking depressing me, this old man, because he's making me remember just how old and how ill my old man is and I'm in the middle of a fucking date. I order another Negroni. This is, this is one about, about you, lady. You're so hot, I almost have a panic attack when I remember that I fucked you. 